Hey guys, uh, this is my picks for the week of, uh, I guess it would be June 11th. Today's Saturday, June 11th. Um, yeah, I pick stuff at yard sales, Goodwill, for uh, resale on eBay. And these are my picks for the week. First up, uh, PlayStation Personal, uh, or Portal, Final Fantasy game. I guess the Final Fantasy series does pretty well, particularly if you can find a guidebook with them. Uh, they can pay a dollar for that. This is one of my funnier finds for the week. This is a Christmas tree star, and it's got $7 on it. They're glued together. And I was at a really busy yard sale. There's probably like 50 people there. And I said, how much you got to have for this? And the woman, to my surprise, said, a dollar. <laughs> and I just started laughing. I said, okay, I'll give you a dollar for that. And everyone around was laughing. I was like, I'll give a dollar for $7 any day. So she said she tried taking it apart once. And uh, I don't know what I'm going to do. Let's try to sell it as is. I think I could get at least 7 bucks for it. I don't know. Um, kind of a novelty thing. You never know. I might just take it apart. A dollar for $7 is a good deal any day of the week. Uh, this item I have high hopes for. Uh, I found it at Goodwill. It's a piece of check glass. Bohemian check glass. Uh, look that up on uh, finished listings on eBay. Pretty cool. Um, I paid $8 for that. And it's pretty beautiful. Good piece, I like it. It's on eBay right now. Let's see how it goes. Um, DKNY pocketbook. Uh, let's see, we got the symbol right there. DKNY, yep. Paid a quarter for that. That should go pretty well. Uh, Tignaello. Tignaello pocketbook. This one actually is really nice. Heavy leather. It's got a chrome clasp, uh, magnetic uh, buckle. Nice interior. That's a nice bag. Nah, uh, probably a knockoff Dolce & Gabbana. Paid like two fifty for that. You should get good money for that, even as is. Uh, this one fooled my wife. Coach bag. It's a nice knockoff, I think. Or it could be real. I, I doubt it's real, but it looks real. So, um, my wife kind of put dibs on that. I don't know if I'm going to be able to sell that. Probably not. Um, another one here. Actually, I paid two dollars for a nice Kelty backpack. Kelty. That guy wanted three. I paid two. Yes, these do really well. The original. I'm getting attacked by a bear. <laughs> My wife actually picked this up. Uh, Fifteen bucks, brand new. Um, it's from a retail store. And they couldn't sell it, and it was very cheap. I'm going to try to sell it on eBay, see how that does. Before I got attacked, I was going to tell you, uh, you know, Super Nintendo, not Super Nintendo, regular, original Nintendo, NES, with six games, Duck Hunt Gun. Duck Hunt Guns go for like 15 bucks by themselves. So, uh, good pickup. I think I paid uh, $8 for this. Um, another one, I like golf clubs, particularly if they're newer. This one's not too new, but it was in great shape, and it had a head cover. Golfers are kind of particular about getting drivers and clubs with head covers. So I uh, paid 5 bucks for this. Uh, I probably expect to see 25 to 30 on that one. It's a good pickup. Um, here's one I couldn't show you last week because it wasn't up here. But I got a pair of these chairs right here. Um, they're Viking Artline chairs. They're mid-century Pretty cool chairs. Um, these ones are basically perfect condition. And there's a pair similar on eBay right now for sale. Uh, best offer, $625. And mine are in better shape. And uh, I have mine on for $300. Or, you know, best offer. So I'm hoping to see a return on that. Probably going to have to sit on them for a while. Um, and back there, I don't know if you can see, this wooden board thing is a primitive bowling game. Made by Sportcraft, and I couldn't find really anything on it. It's all handmade, uh, old wood. I actually, bring it in closer so you guys can see. Pretty cool piece. Uh, Goodwill find, two ninety nine. Yeah. Um. Yeah. So you put your pins down here. You bowl in this direction, and uh, there's a little catch basin here for the pins and ball. Uh, ball return here, actually on an angle so the ball falls back to the beginning. 
and some groove gutters on the side. Nice shape. Um, yeah, good pick, I think. So we get for that. And some updates on some things I sold last week. Uh, the Sigma zoom lens picked for two dollars, sold for thirteen. Uh, Rydell football pads picked for four ninety nine. Those went for fifty one dollars. So a nice little profit there. And uh, the Sony Walkman picked for a dollar, sold for ten dollars and fifty cents. So that's you know ten to one return right there. Take that all day long. And um, yeah, it's a pretty good week overall. See how we do. Uh, check out my auctions, fade to black auctions on eBay. And uh, thanks for tuning in.